Hello everybody, and welcome to another episode of Let's -a Play. Today, we are going to be playing the video game of one of my most old fearsome enemies, Donkey Kong. And we are playing Donkey Kong Country for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System. Wahoo! As you can see, Cranky is playing an old record player. Cranky is the original Donkey Kong from the games that I was in, where I chased a girl who was being not by a monkey. That's the monkey. He's older now. Yet I am the same age. Don't ask the questions. Welcome anyway to Donkey Kong Country. Let's go! File one. One player. Okay. Now, I'm going to do something a little bit different this time. I'm going to start this with a glitch that Wario told me about. That might not be good. Oh, let's find out together, shall we? This is either going to be really impressive or really terrifying. He didn't tell me what it did. He just told me how to do it. So we have to clear out these enemies to get to where we are going. Try not to get hit here. Run real quick and grab the rhino. We just took out those beavers for good measure. Turn on and back. And jump. And we need to make our way back to almost the beginning of the st stage. Eh? About right here, I think he said. Okay. Now we ran up here. We go down here. Grab this. Throw. And watch. And now I'm riding myself, apparently. Okay, note to self, don't listen to Wario. Oh, and we're back with the rhino now. Everything is back as it should be. But for a moment, you saw a monkey riding a monkey. Note to self, don't listen when Wario tells you what to do on glitches. They come out very strange. Okay, anyway, now that the weirdness is out of the way, Welcome to Donkey Kong Country for the Super Nintendo. Today, I am not going to be doing a 100% run. As you can see right there. I'm not doing a 100% run, I'm just playing the game. If we get bonuses, we get bonuses. If we don't get bonuses, well, that's okay. We're going to play through the game and have the fun. I'll probably get some bonuses. If I see them, I might get them. But I'm not going out of my way. I don't want to waste your time with that. Okay, Ropey Rampage. It's very weird playing a game that's not a Mario game. But rather has the grandson of one of Mario's fearsome enemies. It's a very interesting concept for Mario. Okay, so we're busting up some crocodile things in this game, it looks like. And an armadillo! He's easy, though. One pound on the head, and he's a Mario dust. Or a donkey dust. Is donkey dust a thing? Do I want to know if donkey dust is a thing? I'm not too sure I do. It sounds very weird. Like, weirder than Donkey Kong riding himself. Remind me I need to send Donkey Kong a picture of that later. It's a good blackmail material. You never know when he might go back to his old habits of his grandfather. Okay. Take that to... Whoa! Wahoo! Whoa! Okay. And down the hole, because there's a bonus area. Okay. I have to watch the barrels go very carefully here. Very carefully. I think it's number 30. No, number 4. I missed. Donkey Kong is just as sad as Mario. Mario hangs a sad and shame too. Okay. Jump uh, and jump right over him. I would like to get the letter G though. Konge! Now when you get a Konge, you get an extra life. Eh? So we like that. That's so nice. Okay. It's Clanky's cabin. Clanky is the original Donkey Kong. Let's visit him. Sure looks like a Mr. Popular today yesterday. 
Well, you stole the girl! That's alright. Four shades of grey and a two by two character block. That's all we had. And it was a very fearsome adventure, let me tell you. I can't play this game. The colors are all too rich for my poor old eyes. I'm just fine, you crazy monkey. What is your problem? The bananas have more frames and colors than he had in the entire game. I don't know that that is true. His beard swings, waste of flames in his opinion. Hi, that was when we had real gameplay, that was. I jumped over barrels, hit them with a hammer and saved a woman. This game seems better so far. Developed with the latest state-of-the-art 3D worker thingies. In jungle hijinks, stick to the tree tops to earn extra lives in. Also, he's hitting his own grandson. What is up with that? He's a very fearsome old man, let me tell you what. Now off you go. See if you can't finish this ridiculous quest without my help. That's only because you can't do it anymore, you crazy old ape. Now don't steal any more women, okay? Meanwhile, Reptile Rumbly. Okay, ooh, blue crocodiles. I probably shouldn't question a blue crocodiles or a thingy, considering that I live in a world where mushroom people can talk. Okay, extra life. Eh? That's so nice. Whee! Why can't Mario do that? Mario wants to jump out of walls, blast off, and smash into enemies with his face. Okay, woo, 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 Extra lifey. Okay. Whoa! I came off after that a little faster than I expected. I'm not going after those bananas. That seems like a trap down there. Okay. The star barrels are the halfway points here. Now, in my games, uh, sometimes I have flags, or I have many football goalposts. Either way, my checkpoints are better than his checkpoints. That's all I have to say about that. Okay, grab the bananas, which are the coins of this game. That seems more and less practical at the same time. I mean, you can eat them, they're food, but you can't buy things with them. Or maybe you can. What do I know? I'm just a Mario. Okay, bash the sneakies. Now if I'm right, what I heard... Bananas! In the ground. Who buries bananas? And puts snakes to protect them. Mario's very unsure about this game. It seems a very strange. Okay. Cool capers. Ooh, that's some very nice music. Mario does like this music. It's a very nice underwater theme. I like uh, the theme from my Mario 3 game a little bit better, but that's because it had me, Mario. Ooh, a banana. Ooh, a hidden tunnel. Okay, what's it down here? Just a bunch of bananas, which is fine. Donkey Kong needs to eat, I suppose. I'll allow it. Okay. A down arrow. Let's see what's down here. A fishy! Come! I shall name you Salmon Ray. Because of reasons involving a lot of slowdown, apparently. Fish, did you break my game? Okay, we're back to normal. I'm not sure what that was about. It was very strange. Must have been a weird glitch in the system. Okay, going, going down now. Oh no, my fishy! Fishy! It's Mario! I mean Donkey Kong! Hmm, come to think of it. Uh, ooh, what's this? Uh, a golden ostrich. Okay. We're going to continue our swimming journey. Oh, I missed the O. I wonder where the O was. Oh well. Getting the letter seems to just be an extra life. Eh? Not a big deal. Mario has a lot of lives. Eh? But he lost his fishy. And that's also sad. There he goes. Goodbye, fishy. Enjoy your life. See you again, baby. Okay. Well, we're moving on. 
from the Funkiest of Lights. Well, do it, my name is a Funky Kong. A audacious Jumbo Bell can launch you to any point on the island. Most unfortunately, it can only send you to a place you've already been. Which is a complete and total bummer, let me tell you. Oh, dudes, my name's Funky Kong. Okay, you're just repeating yourself. We're leaving now. We've only been here. Bear the Cannon Canyon. This sounds interesting. Okay, this is interesting. Whee! Mario needs to take a vacation to this place. This looks like a lot of fun. And they don't seem to have kidnapped princesses. Just bananas and crocodiles of various colors that don't make much sense to Mario. Okay. Mario's bouncing. Mario switching to his little buddy, little Mario. Okay, his name's Diddy Kong. And we have another bonus area. Hmm, fish on the right, bananas on the right. Okay, we didn't get the fish on the left or the bananas on the right. But that's okay too. When you get three of those bonus animal gold thingies, they take you out of the level into a bonus area. Mario's not sure if he'll be showing that off this time. But that's okay too. Mario's main problem is whenever you do that, you have to start at the beginning or the halfway point again. So if you beat most of the level, it doesn't matter. You lose your progress. Mario doesn't like that so much. Okay. And we have these things and the G. And we are heading through a tunnel of mystery. And we're at very naughty's lair. He sounds very naughty. Here we go! Okay, let's see what's in here. It's a giant beaver thing! I jump on his head, because that's what Mario would do in his Mario games. Okay, it seems like he's going a little faster. Meanwhile, I know that we skipped that random girl's tent, so I will check it out later. I beat the beaver! Mario beat his beaver. That's... I know that's a joke there somewhere. It's a good thing Wario's not here. He'd probably say something crude right now. Okay, so now we are in World 2. And that's going to conclude part 1 of this playthrough game series. So come back next time, and Mario will do part 2 in World 2 with Winky's Walkaway, which also sounds very crude. This game's a little awkward so far, but that's okay too. Alrighty, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed my video game commentary playthrough. So thank you so much for watching my video commentary. See you next time. Goodbye!